Hi, I'm Mitchell Strapinchik with Chicago Media Action, Chicago Indie Media, WLUW and WHPK Radio. I think uh, what you could look for, I think it's now become so blatantly obvious that it's become increasingly easy to um, 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 practically turn on at any point um, any show within Fox and discover um, instances of this. Um, what I would actually advise um, would be, and now this has increasingly become easier because there are now um, other shows that have kind of taken to or skewer to Fox, um, both rivals in the ostensible news space like MSNBC, but also shows like The Daily Show, which not only comment on Fox, but also do it in a kind of critical and, frankly, funny manner. Um, Fox, in their very bad attempts to try to create a rival right-wing comedy show, have failed utterly. They haven't drawn an audience, and frankly, they weren't very funny to begin with. Um, so, there, there may be something there. Um, it would be very easy to just watch these other channels and just do a point-by-point -point comparison, especially regarding other shows that other points or issues, and especially where a lot of issues tend to, um, and this has been a criticism of the main corporate media on the whole, You'll watch this stuff, um, and you will discover that not only is a story talked about on a channel, but it's usually the same story talked about on all the channels. The big reason why that's the case is because of not only the increasing, cor the increasing corporate concentration of ownership, but also the increased reliance on officialdom as sources for news and stories, and leaks and other developments. Very rarely do you find um, uh, corporate news outlets going into, say, poor neighborhoods to discover what toxins are being out unveiled out there. Um, that would be a humongous story, um, but it might irk the companies that produce those toxins who happen to pay for um, the advertising that pays for the newspaper, especially where your newspaper is on the chopping block anyway, as increasingly a lot of newspapers are. Um, that kind of, watching this kind of comparison of, of media across these sources, and there's been a little bit of an improvement in this count. I think would be one thing to do. Um, diversify your media diet in that respect. Um, for those who are just adamant about that, that is an increasingly shrinking number uh, to the point where um, they may well have to find other avenues um, or perhaps um, discover that the media outlets that they had had may no longer be around, which is maybe the great irony about this entire set of circumstances, that what we saw is this concentration of media ownership. Um, may well fall um, through its own machinations over time and in ways that most of most people don't know the details, especially in the policy sphere, of how this happens and how people um, can affect it and have affected it. Um, but they may find themselves in an increasingly shrinking minority um, and uh, may want to rethink their political persuasions.